Hello and welcome to this vlog! I have a harmonica here. Alright. Yeah, anyway. I'm gonna learn how to play this. I'm going, it's getting dark. I'm gonna learn how to play this. I'll try. And, uh, yeah. It's one of the special ones you can, um, inhale and exhale, like. Anyway, uh, then I'll play that and do something. I have big news! Jack and I are going to be talking this for quite a while. Assassin's Creed 4, Black Flag. Bit late. It's been announced. And we've seen the trailer. I'm going to put a link later on to a tra uh, Ubisoft. A trailer to a link to the Ubisoft official Ubisoft one. Because I know that they won't care. There's other people who have it, but. They might be concerned. Anyway, put a link to Ubisoft in the description. Uh, I'll do that like some other day. Or well, today. So if you're watching it today, it won't be there. Unless Jack does it. Jack, if you're watching this, put a link in the description for the Ubisoft. <laughs> Ubisoft official launch trailer for Assassin's Creed 4. And also there's a one that's displaying his... Displaying Edward Cannon. Okay, I'll tell you quick details. Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Set like the set early 1700s. Like 1715s is where the map is. Caribbean Islands. And there's like three main cities, Havana, Nahuasa, or something like that, and that's like the pirate, Havana's like capital of Cuba. Um, there's like, okay, okay, capital of Cuba, Havana, should have done this research, but I didn't. Nahuasa, whatever that's called, some pronounce, pronunciation in foreign accent, that's like the base of all pirates. And uh, another one, where it's like English control city, so there's... Mostly, there's this two point. Okay, from the time period in the trailer, and also the locations, there'll be two main enemies: will be Spanish Legion and the English. Um, Edward Kenway, like we're assuming he's English. I don't know because it was because of Hasten. But um, apparently, he dies when he's six years old. If you've read the book, I'm sorry, I just spoiled it. Spoilers alert! Spoiler alert! Uh, if you've read Assassin's Creed Forsaken, skip. Okay, okay, Assassin's Creed Forsaken. Uh, Apparently Edward Kenway dies like it's when Haven Six. Okay, so yeah. Okay, cool. Um, now Assassin's Creed Four set in the seventeen fifteens, maybe get later or some of like that. And uh, he's a pirate trained by assassins, and apparently he was like a pirate and was young and greedy and like uh, in unintelligent, like stupid, like you no know, foolish. And then the assassin brought him in, say, like made him, trained him, made him like less selfish, like more selfless. And follow the creed more and be like more respectful of his abilities, I guess. Uh, yeah, and they've got he's got like, see, I think uh, Ubisoft has talked about it, and at these different conferences, and apparently sort of in the trailer you can see him putting two pistols in his front, here like one across and then like two in the back like Connor did in Assassin's Creed Three. Apparently you start with one and you can upgrade it to like four. Uh, dual wielding is apparently it's going to be much better. Like a lot of people were uh, disappointed with the dual wielding in Assassin's Creed Three. Because, like, you could, like, pretty much do... They said you could do with any weapon, which is sort of a lie. You could do with any weapon with the knife. Pretend it's a knife. Uh, is left hand. So, like, they were thinking you could do with any weapon combination. Hopefully in this, like, it's more like you can you know, hold two pistols at once or hold a sword and a pistol, which is what he's been seen to do in some of the screenshots. Like, he's got two swords and it's awesome. It's going to be good. Uh, and... And uh main thing is like about sixty percent of stuff will be done on land, forty percent will be stuff of like story stuff will be done on the ships. And um it's gonna be all the okay, so it's gonna be about all this seamless stuff. Like seamless gameplay, like no loading. They've figured something out in the anvil next engine, make it awesome. Where you basically you can free run around your ship, woohoo, which is a lot of people and including me, I wanna do that in Assassin's Creed Three. A lot of people wanted to do that. I wanted to do that, and now you can do it. Uh, there's like no loading, you just like sail around wherever, get out of your ship and go into the place and there's like no loading, apparently. It's gonna be awesome. They might do background loading, some tricks, I don't know. I don't care, as long as it's seamless. No frame rate slowing down, it's also, it's on the PS3. It's coming out October 29th. I think that's pretty much all the details. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna say the release date right now. Uh, in the trailer, October 29th, 2013. Uh, PS3, Xbox 360. I don't know about PC. Whether that's, I think it might be later, and um, November sometime. And uh, PS3 has apparently got some 60 minute uh, bonus thing, just like Assassin's Creed 3 did. And uh, the PS3 apparently is like 
it's kind of like they said that stuff about the Cena stuff. Don't know about it's going. I don't know whether they're talking about the PS4 only or the PS3. There's been no word of the next Xbox on your PS4 because that's the only one that's been announced. Or it's been announced, talked about, no release, no like showing of the console. But we know it's coming and. Apparently, like, it's October 29th, but it's not going to come out on the next-gen thing till later, so... Yeah, uh, PS3 stuff. Weather might be slower. Uh, so I'm probably going to buy it on PS3. And maybe buy it twice. Because they're talking about stuff about exclusive on PS3, exclusive on PS4. So it's like, both people on both consoles get stuff. So I'm thinking about maybe... Well, I don't know whether it's a waste of money or not. I'll we'll have a look at stuff later when it comes out. Uh, exclusive exclusivity. I might buy it on PS3 because I know I'll play it on that. Um, buy it on PS3 and uh, then get PS4 and get on that as well. See a difference so I can do like a difference video for you guys, I guess. Show you the awesome power of PS4. Watch Dogs gameplay. Hopefully, I have my HD PVR by then, but it won't be probably. Won't be it might be compared with the PS4. Hopefully they still use HDMI or component stuff. So you'll be able to record stuff. And yeah. Awesome. Of course we'll be still doing PC stuff on this channel. For six minute vlog. Sorry it's a bit long but this is Assassin's Creed 4 details. And uh. Mouth organ. I can't play. I don't know what I'm doing. Anyone can do it, but they don't know what they're doing. Like the philosophy. Theory about the notes and all that stuff. Anyway, that's Creed 4. Was there anything else about the game? Hmm. Yeah, uh, Edward Kenway is Hayton's father, so he's Connor's grandfather. And Ezio Altatore de Firenze. Ezio Altatore de Firenze uh, is like either his, either, is either Edward Kenway's great. Great great grandfather or great great great. No wait, either his great grandfather or his great great grandfather. Like Ezio is either yeah, Ezio is either Grant Edward Kenway's great grandfather or great great. Okay, For like three generations or two, depending on how long they live. Since he died in like fifteen twelve, two hundred and three year difference. I think it might be three generations, three or four, three four generation difference. But yeah, it's pretty exciting. As more details get released, I'll do some more stuff about it and maybe have another video with Jack talking about stuff. Me and Jack talking about stuff. We might do a trailer breakdown. Who knows? But uh, we've come up with some philosophies about the story and what's going to happen. And uh, hopefully, we might be able to film that. Get some stuff out to you. Because I've seen some trailer breakdowns they did like as soon as it released. It's pretty bad. Just saying. Can't believe I just said that. Anyway, uh, yes, harmonica, Assassin's Creed 4. We filmed quite a lot of Let's Plays, so we have a good reserve. Don't know, we have his Plant Side 2 stuff, I think. And, um, we deleted heaps of, we had deleted like two, 300 gig worth of Plant Side 2 things. Because he ran out of space recording, Jack ran out of his hard drive space. Recording the last place, but that's unnecessary. Eight minute vlog. Sorry, so long, but Assassin's Creed 4 details. Anyway, uh, I might do a better video about this later. Trailer analysis breakdown. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Clear to jump right to watch the next vlog. Uh, I'm not gonna do subscribing anymore. If you like, if you like this video, click like. If you if you want to see more, click subscribe. You can see I might now new videos when come out when they come out. Uh. Bottom right is to see the channel. Annotation at the bottom right at the end of the video, see the channel. Annotation at the left, bottom left at the end of the video, see the feature video. I think it's still Happy Wheels. We do Happy Wheels. Yeah, if you have like Happy Wheels. Woo! Anyway. <laughs> it's a reference. You should get it. If you have seen YouTube. You should get it. Anyway. Dope one signing off. Peace out. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching. Check you out. Videos, they're good. Yeah, yeah. I have to come up with some catchphrases. You know, derp army, not derp army. Sip, sip, derp something. Yeah, goodbye.